Hey everybody, so today I just wanted to show you this uh, cool booster I made, which basically is completely resizable, and the resizing does change how the parameters work in thrust, in the efficiency, and in the general burn time, and obviously mass. So I thought this was kind of neat. Somebody kind of asked for it, and I was like, okay, I can probably do this. So if we go like this, we turn the cone on and off. Apparently the cone does not do a lot though. Um, it's one of those weird situations, but we'll get to it there. All right, so I also made the gems that are used on the Delta twos and they don't have tops because the booster tops seem to be not working very well. I'll show you in a second. Uh, where is it here? And there we go. Okay, so these are some of the boosters that we have, and if we just quickly... So, firing the boosters, we can see that they sort of fire sideways. Um, they are in beta, so there's a lot of things that need to be adjusted. Um, like, for some reason, the booster color ends up being a bit green. Not the end of the world, but I've already had one person comment on it. Um, yes, it's not just a visual um, image. The thrusters actually do fire in that direction. So with these uh, Delta II era gem boosters, you have to actually wait for them to run out because if you were to like release them right now, they would slam into the back of the rocket as they sort of fly off sideways. So just a quick note, they actually do fire in that direction. And as we sort of fly up here, we're probably well into space because these boosters are incredibly overpowered um, for this tiny little rocket. Um, and then we can run this one here. It has the same plume, but this is what it looks like in space. Again, probably turn this a little bit more orangey to avoid the green. And this is gonna run for quite some time. Because it's so tall, uh, the runtime is quite long on this booster. So just something to think about. And obviously I can have a little bit of turning here, but the boosters don't actually have any torque in them, unlike a regular engine, which has a gimbal. Uh, so pretty much the torque is just coming from the module up here, but you know These can be quite a bit of fun and again, they're designed to get your rocket into space